Today, we're doing a stroller review. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole, and on this channel, we talk about things from product reviews to parenting tips and advice. So if you are new here, definitely consider subscribing. Today, we're gonna talk about the Baby Trend Sit to Stand Stroller. Um, a while back, I did a video about my City Select double stroller, and I wanted to give you guys a more affordable option to transport both a toddler and an infant or two toddlers. There are a lot of different options with this stroller and it is about seven times less expensive than the, the Baby Jogger City Select Double. So I think it's always good to have a couple of good sensible options. Um, I'm gonna walk you through a voiceover of the video that I shot showing you all the features. And um, yeah, so without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay hey guys, so let's get started looking at the sit and stand stroller. Let's start off by taking a look at the canopy. It's gonna have a pretty decent sized canopy that'll keep out those UV rays. And then moving over to the seat here in the front, it is going to have a five point harness. So that is really great. The front seat is also gonna have a weight capacity of up to 50 pounds. Also very cool. The snack tray is here. It's gonna have a little built in cup holder. Um, and then there is the little footrest at the bottom. Taking a closer look around the side, this is what the suspension looks like on the front. There is a really decent sized basket and the basket on the stroller is actually designed to be accessed from the side. So this is the back of the stroller and where the toddler would sit starting at age two and a half or so. Also has a weight capacity of up to 50 pounds. And then here is showing you the two recline options that that front seat has. Not great, but it's there, <laughs> right? So here is the bench seat. Also, like I mentioned, a weight capacity of up to 50 pounds. And this one is going to have a three point harness here. Start using this jump seat at two and a half years old. And then the platform is also down here. Age recommendation, also two and a half years old. And um, these are the parking brakes for the stroller. Um, they're both foot brakes. And then right over here is the harness, which would be used if they were standing on the platform. And then coming over here to look at the parent console, it's gonna have two cup holders and this little tiny compartment. I don't think I could fit my phone in there. I'm really not quite sure what I'd put in there. But um, here is the unlock feature to how to close the stroller. You'd actually do both of those simultaneously and the stroller would fold into the closing position. You'll notice also on the jump seat, there are two cup holders. So there's not a shortage of cup holders here. <laughs> Let's see what it looks like with my kiddos in. This is Ty, he is four years old, and I am putting him into the jump seat. And we are just buckling the three-point harness um, and then just kind of tightening it up there. Super easy, he was super comfortable there. And here's Jakey, he will be two in July, and he has the five-point harness on. And um, yeah, I'd say the steering is pretty decent. It's not gonna be as good as the higher end options, but again, this stroller is seven times less expensive than the other stroller that I've made a video of. So definitely keep that in mind. I'm also gonna show you here how Ty can actually flip around and be facing the other way. He is just holding on to those two cup holders for balance. And um, using the platform is really easy for him to do. Okay, so now we're gonna take a look at how you can use this stroller with your infant car seat as well. You're actually gonna fold down the tray and your car seat is going to fit right on top of it. Um, this tray can be moved to the front of the stroller if you'd like to have it closer to you as well. So that's also an option. Closing the stroller is actually really easy to do. You're just gonna squeeze those two red buttons that I showed earlier and the stroller is just going to fold closed. Really simple. The stroller weight itself is 27 pounds, so it's not super heavy um, and also not very cumbersome for a double stroller. Um, to unfold, you're just going to simply um, release the little latch on the side and unfold the stroller. The things that I love about this stroller is that the price point is super, super low as compared to its competitors, and it is a great option for parents who have a toddler and also expecting a new baby. I'm loving the longevity of this stroller. By using the infant car seat, and then transitioning to your toddler using the jump seat, you can get years of use out of this stroller. 
Okay guys, so that is it for the video today. If you enjoyed it and found it helpful, definitely be sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Leave me any questions or any comments that you have down in the comment box down below. And as always, all of the information and links to the products mentioned will be in the description box. And I will see all of you guys next time.